Hi judges! Welcome to another segment of One Our Liwag Memorial High School Senior High School Math TV. For today's example, find the standard equation of the circle concentric with x squared plus 4x plus y squared minus 6y plus 9 is equal to 0 and has the same circumference as x squared plus 14x plus y squared plus 10y plus 62 is equal to 0. Before we answer this problem, let us first analyze all the given. For the first condition, we are given uh, an equation. So, the equation is x squared plus 4x plus y squared minus 6y plus 9 is equal to 0. It states here that the circle that we need to find is concentric with this equation. Therefore, when we say concentric, again, they share the same center. Okay, if they share the same center, all we have to do is to get first the center. Okay, and in order for us to get the center, we need to complete the square. x squared plus 4x plus 4 divided by 2 is 2, squared is 4, plus y squared minus 6y, negative 6 divided by 2 is negative 3, squared is positive 9, is equal to? Transpose all the constant to the other side. Therefore, that is positive 9. We transpose this to the right side. It becomes negative 9. Plus all the values that we have completed. So, we have negative 9 plus 4 plus 9. Okay. Factor out x squared. That is positive. Plus square root of 4 is 2. Quantity squared. Plus y squared. So, that is y that is negative minus square root of 9, which is 3, quantity squared is equal to negative 9, positive 9, cancel out. Therefore, that is 4. And the center now is located at negative 2 and positive 3, while the radius is equal to 2. But then, we will not consider this radius. We will only consider the center because it is, uh, it is stated in the problem that it is concentric with this equation, but not, but they do not share the same center. So where do we get the center? We will be getting the center from the, uh, we will be getting the radius, we will be getting the radius from our second condition. Again, we will be getting our radius from the second condition and has the same circumference as x squared plus 14x plus y squared plus 10y plus 62 is equal to 0. So in order for us to get the radius, it states here that they, uh, they have the same circumference. Okay, always remember that if the problem states that they share the same circumference, therefore, they share the same radius, but they do not share the same center. Again, we have, they share the same radius. When it's stated in the problem that they have the same circumference. Do not forget that. Okay, so let us first complete the square. x squared plus 14x plus 14 divided by 2, 7. Squared is 49 plus y squared plus 10y plus 10 divided by 2, 5 squared, that becomes 25, is now equal to, transpose all the constant to the other side, that is negative 62, plus 49, plus 25. Okay, let us now try to factor. It is now x plus 7, quantity squared, plus y plus 5, quantity squared, is equal to, 49 plus 25 is 74. Okay. And negative 62 plus 74 is positive 12. We will not anymore be getting the center. Okay. But the center of this one is located at negative 7 and negative 5. But we will not use the center. So what are we using? We will be using r squared. And r squared is equal to 12. Okay. So let us now try to substitute. The values now are the center is located at negative 2 and positive 3 and r squared is equal to positive 12. The standard equation is x minus h quantity squared plus 
y minus k quantity squared is equal to r squared. Substitute this h and k, we'll be having x plus 2 quantity squared plus y minus 3 quantity squared is equal to 12. And this is the equation of the circle which is concentric to this equation but it has the same circumference as this equation. Remember that if it is concentric, they share the same center but if they, they have the same circumference, therefore they share the same radius.